Hey guys, what's going on? Today I'm going to unbox and show you how to use uh, external hard drive. So this is the one that I got. I want to. I got a one terabyte. Um, and it contains the part of portable hard drive, a USB cable, and a quick guide. You guys know good well I don't do nothing about no reading. So this is what it looks like. Very nice, sleek. It's a Moxon or Maxon. Um, depend on how they pronounce it. And then let's see, what does it have? It's the Slim Series, which I like. Um, it's a portable hard drive. So let's go with how we set this up, right? So this is the USB cable that came with it. And we're going to first and put it in. So let me make sure I have this right. Nope. You want to just insert that. And then I'm going to place my hard drive down. This holds a terabyte worth of memory. So that's like... A lot if you're the type of person that likes to uh, download stuff I mean we'll record and videotape a lot of things um, if you do like YouTube and you want to save all your projects and not really keep them on your cell phones then you definitely want to use this or something like it one terabyte is good it holds a lot of memory um, I'll have to see like how many files that is but let's just say it's uh, good enough to last you a year. So here is the USB portion and I have a port on the side of my computer as you can see There's the port There's the port right there and we're just gonna put it in Boom So we just inserted it and now You see that where it says new file that is the external hard drive and I have a bunch of things in there well not a lot but I downloaded some things so now that the file is in there let me just show you how much information is already inside of this so you just double click and there you go stuff from things that I've done. I have a lot of stuff from Final Cut, the program I use to edit, um, photo shoots, interviews, all that good stuff. So once you've finished putting your files in, let's just do a temporary file, right? So we want to put, uh, let's put the Hello World thumbnails in. So basically, I'm just going to be copying the Hello World thumbnail into my drive. And look at what happens. I drag it right on in. And there it is loading up. It's copying 4832, all of those items. And now it's inside. And the cool thing about this, it's in alphabetical order. It's in alphabetical order. And it's the original file stayed on my desktop. Isn't that cool? So when you're done uploading whatever files you wanted to upload, you want to scroll down to where... I didn't name my... Um, I did not go ahead and name my external hard drive. So we already know we want to safely eject it. So you press that button and boom, it's done. So now that is safely ejected... I'm going to then, oops, I don't want to put my hand in your way. I could then take the cord out and boom, and that's it. So now all of that information is inside here so it doesn't clutter up my computer. And that's the purpose, right? So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, this is the Maximon hard drive, portable, USB and it's compatible with any computer. As you can see, I have a Mac, Apple Mac computer. So if you have a HP or anything like that, it should work for you there too. I like the sleekness of it. 
I like that it's so sleek and very thin. Um, I like to protect my stuff. Um, so what I do is I disconnect everything again. Let me just go ahead and don't mind my little chest set. I use that as a <laughs> I use that as a, a a prop to prop up my things, but I do love chess. Um, I think if you ever catch me on Hello World, you hear me talking about that a lot. Um, so this is the box that it came in. And the USB cord went in there. So we're going to put the USB cord right back inside nicely. Put it right back inside. Close that. The, what's the purpose of having a hard drive if you're not going to take care of it? And so then, this is the original case that it came in. It's plastic. As you can see, I didn't tear it all apart. It's very nice. It's that plastic that'll cut you if you're not careful. And then I'm just going to put that back in there. Close it. And now my hard drive is protected. Bam. So... If I ever want to get anything off, then I just go and use this. I would prefer to keep it on the computer, but since that's not possible, you have your external hard drive. And then with these, you can collect them and keep them. And once I fill this one up, once I fill this hard drive up, I'm probably going to put a marker. I'm probably going to uh, mark it, you know, for what year it was. So that if I ever go back and need to look at uh, particular items that I, are in a particular hard drive, once this is full, then I'll have an idea. So keep your stuff safe, keep it protected, and definitely, um, you know, do the right thing. I love this. Yes.